What up, guys? I'm Tanner Brungart. And I'm Steve-O. And, and this, this is, is the world's, world's largest trampoline. trampoline. Yeah. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one second. Hold on. So a little over a year ago, I was enjoying my typical morning scroll through Instagram when I came across this video of these guys flipping off a giant swing attached to a giant bridge. Being a lover of extreme sports and adrenaline rushes all my life, I thought this was so freaking cool and I knew I had to find out more about the guys who built this thing. I did some research and discovered there are a group of acrobats called the Didi Squad all the way from Slovenia. Yeah, I didn't know where that was either, but I want to move there after seeing all the things these guys were allowed to do. Yep, that's a trampoline this time, also attached to a bridge. This is what happened the last time I tried having fun at my local bridge. Oh, and the time before that, and the time before that. Anyways, after watching more of these guys' videos, I decided to reach out. And a month later, I got invited to join them on a trip going to Costa Rica. I was so far out of my comfort zone that whole trip, but I left with a new highest cliff jump and three really cool new friends. Jan, Milji, and Gap. Fast forward a year to present day, and the DD Squad just sent me another invite this time to check out their newest project, the world's biggest trampoline. Oh, but, but I thought I had the biggest... Fine, let's see it. So, we're doing it. We're just, we're walking up. My turn. Oh boy, there you go, lady. Whoa, what the f <laughs> This feels insane. Get, get Whoa, it's actually kind of bouncy. What's up, how are you? Cap? I'm great, how are you guys? Oh, man. Mil G, is it? Yours is the one name I Yeah, me usually, dude. That was pretty good. Yeah, yes. was pretty good. Let's go. Yeah, it becomes stronger. Dude, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, say Perfect. something. Say your last words. Um, yeah, they really are going to be last words. Uh, uh, <laughs> how big is this? Uh, 30 by 30 feet. Okay, to the moon. Okay. Two. Come on, Tannen right. Yower, Brandon Yower. Yeah. One, two, one, more. two. Yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I didn't land on my feet. No. I know. Yeah. This thing was definitely unlike any trampoline I'd ever been on. Hardly any of my experience was translating because of its delayed bounce, and I kept trying to land on my feet, which you're not supposed to do. Oh. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go get a knee transplant, and I'll see you guys next week. This trampoline actually hurts, all right? Looks, looks deceived. It's literally just rope. Like, look at my knee when I get up. It hurts. But after only being in LA for a couple of hours, this trip was already off to a really fun start. I reunited with some friends, got wrecked by the big trampoline, had a flip battle where we both got wrecked by the trampoline. Oh! oh. Whoa! But something even cooler was about to happen. Yeah, dude. I'm Tanner. Tanner. Nice yeah, dude. What's up? Yep, that's Steve-O. <laughs> the stunt legend himself came to check out what these guys had created. And in my mind, I'm thinking, Steve-O's crazy. Like, he's gonna want to get launched, right? But he was actually pretty nervous. But once his girlfriend went first in those high platform shoes, he didn't really have a choice. <laughs> You good? <laughs> I didn't like that. <laughs> I loved watching him on the trampoline, but there are some other things you just have to do when Steve-O comes over. Oh, guys, I'm here oh. with Steve-O and he's about to shoot me in the back with a paintball gun. Yeah. <laughs> it brings me no pleasure. Oh. Oh. We're gonna arm you with a paintball gun, and lift you up with a crane, and then you can shoot the bunny running on the world's biggest trampoline down there. Will you be up to? I will do that for you. <laughs> <laughs> that's the kind of guy I am. <laughs> Not only is it Easter Sunday, it's rabbit season. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> You're a good yeah. shot. <laughs> It, 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 it went off. It just, I it, just, <laughs> it just went off. <laughs> so it's the next day. Just crawled out of bed. And this is what I walk outside to. The trampoline's done and the uh, first jump is going down. Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs>
You might think this is something I'd feel comfortable doing based on some of my past videos, but I can promise you I was totally freaking out while debating whether or not I would be jumping off this giant tower. And in avoidance of that anxiety, I sat safely on the ground with the leaders of the DD squad to ask them some questions. Well guys, I'm here with Gap, Yanni, and Milji. So what did you guys use for this trampoline to build it? We basically rented a bunch of aluminum here, uh, okay. like from LA, and we just like sent the huge, huge package uh, <laughs> which cost us like four thousand dollars so all together for both ways uh, just to bring the, the springs and the net and straps and everything wow uh, okay sorry um, to buy a new one I would estimate it around forty thousand dollars or something Wow. Uh, just the frame. And, yeah just the frame <laughs> so I have to ask this next question uh, just for the average viewer why <laughs> Why build this? Why go through all the trouble? It's to satisfy the inner child. Okay. We don't want to be adults yet. A lot of people just don't do that fun stuff. Yeah. They were dreaming about. So we want to do that. Make it happen. Yeah. I think some things just do doesn't need to make sense or be productive. Yeah. It can be for fun. It can be yeah. for fun, yeah. So like how are you guys gonna outdo this? Like what's next? Because <laughs> 60 by 60 feet <laughs> <laughs> Not, Don't worry, we always have more ideas. We have regular brainstormings when we get drunk. And, <laughs> <laughs> Sick, boys. Cool. I appreciate it. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Guys, go subscribe to the DD Squad because they obviously put a ton of work into their stuff and they're awesome. Appreciate and it. Because I said so. <laughs> Thanks. The rest of day two consisted of, you know, a few unicorn rides. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Beating their own record of the highest bounce on this thing. Three! Yeah. Oh, my god. oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Our first time jumping off of the crane. Two, one. Yeah. Oh, that is high. Oh, wow. Whoa. Perfect. Pasha, a Red Bull free runner, almost yep, dying. Yep, yep. No yeah. way! Oh my! It's things like that that make me not want to try that. Dom, also a Red Bull athlete, almost dying. Gap, almost dying. Well, uh, yeah, we're just gonna let him in. No, no. Oh, 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 oh. Dude. No more. No more. Are you still trying this? Yeah, one more. Oh my. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. No, no! So Especially off Dude. The well, now my uh, flip off here is going to seem extremely lame. <laughs> and to end the day, I finally got myself to at least climb up the tower and check it out. Oh wow, yeah, this is this is very high. <laughs> On day three, this is what I walked outside to. I don't know what I was expecting next, but. <laughs> We have a straight up hamster ball right here. <laughs> this giant inflatable ball weighed over 100 pounds and even the DD squad had no idea what would happen if we bounced it with someone inside. I, I don't know how the bounces will go and how much it will like roll. Yeah. And how, how much <laughs> up and lost you're gonna get. I might just leave this one to you guys because uh, <laughs> I don't know if we will be able to bounce it anyway. But. but of course, after one quick test and my clear disapproval. You cannot put a person in there. <laughs> they did indeed put a person in there. Billy, are you getting in that thing? No! No <laughs> way, dude! Yeah, I was surprised. It actually went pretty well. Um, no one got hurt, and this guy went the highest out of everybody. Oh! How was that? Hey! <laughs> that was until... Why do I say yes to shit? I'm terrified right now! 
Get this over with. Yo. Oh. 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 my god. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Oh. Ah. Let me out of here. <laughs> that was terrifying. I'm free. Hug me. <laughs> I decided to relax for a while after having survived the hamster ball, but came back to join just as the evening shenanigans began. Oh, <laughs> oh. Yo! I did! Yeah! Oh! oh. 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 Yo! It's the last day before the trampoline had to be taken down, and while I was getting launched a few more times to take a thumbnail, I realized how much I'd bruised my back from the three days of jumping, and came to my conclusion about the tower jump. I really wanted to get myself to jump off the tramp on the tower, but my back is just wrecked. So yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Literally no one is pressuring me, just myself, but uh, yeah, sometimes you just gotta go with how you feel and I feel like I shouldn't. <laughs> I had actually made this decision about four other times. This is just so far out of my comfort zone. Certainly not going off the tram. I don't think I can jump off the tram. But now I knew for sure that I was not gonna do it. So I just laid down inside with some ice on my back as the sunset drew near, and I began to drift off into an evening nap. And it was pretty peaceful. Except for the haunting thought that I'd never have another chance to do the jump, that everything would be sent back to Slovenia tomorrow, wherever the hell that is, that I know I'm fully capable if I could just stop giving in to the fear and channel a little bit of courage. <sighs> and so, freshly adrenalized by the invasive yet necessary thoughts, I began climbing. How's that feel? I can sleep tonight. I literally tried to take a nap earlier and I couldn't stop thinking about it, so. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. That was one of the coolest things I've ever seen. Let's go! That was one of the coolest things, bro. He's I can't like, believe I just insane. did that. That was awesome, Tanner. Thank Respect, you. Respect, really. Thank Respect. You. Respect from the DD squad. <laughs> we started a movement. Literally, everyone is up on the tower now. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, and um... What else, Lou? <laughs> oh yeah, I almost forgot. Bloopers, for those of you that made it till the end. Oh shit. Dude, I just went like, oh my god, where the f***? <laughs>
Where am I? If you're bouncing really close to the edge and you just take one no, right big away, one that shoots you back, yeah, like that's the most that's the only the dangerous dog. part about this. So just be a little bit more mindful. That appears to be dialed up. Oh, oh. I just can't believe I saw your penis before I ever met you. I feel very personal. That's kind of crazy. Hey everybody, I'm Steve. <laughs> he really went in there and he said, Come on, let's do it. <laughs> that was crazy, man. <laughs> yeah, oh, 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 oh! No! Uh, oh, shit! Let's switch the camera, guy. Are you doing it off the tramp or the frame? Uh, I'm going off the tramp because this is what I want to do. Okay. And what you should do, guys, you should subscribe to Tanner or something like that. Cheers, mate.